Hey guys, I'm here with a Bath & Body Works candle review. I'm going through a lot of candle reviews today. I have like six candle reviews I need to do today, so you're gonna be seeing me in the same outfit for all six of these reviews. They will probably be spread out through the week though when I upload them, but I'm recording them all today because I have a lot here that I need to record. So, this review is for Bath & Body Works Harvest Pear. This is one that was out with the rest of the fall since this was a new one this year with the fall collections. It has the pictures of the uh, pears on the front there. It's got the lid like that, that kind of braided lid there. And I'll read the description here. On the bottom it says sweet roasted pear, cinnamon sugar crumble, freshly whipped buttercream. And then on the side here it has another little thing. It says Celebrate the abundance of the season by indulging in this delicious new blend of freshly picked pear, sweet cinnamon sugar crumble, and lush buttercream. So I really enjoyed this candle, guys. This was a really good candle. It, you really get the pear. I really get the pear, and then I also got a real, it's like a real sugary pear. It's a uh, cinnamon sugar pear, but then it's a bakery note as well. I really got like a bakery scent. It says crumble, like a bakery crumble. Is that what it said? Cinnamon sugar crumble. Yeah, I got the crumble type of scent. With the cinnamon and sugar on the pear. It's almost like a little, you know, just like a little crumble on a little plate. Like a little crust cinnamon sugar and pears in there. And like some uh, juicy, like, uh, filling with the pears and different things like that. It's, it, that's what it's like. It's like that kind of a dessert. It's really, really good, guys. And the fresh buttercream, I don't know, freshly whipped buttercream. I I maybe get a little bit of that, but I mostly just get like a, like I said, the sweet pears with the sugar and cinnamon on there, and then the like the crust crumble type of note. On cold sniff, I did, when I first did my haul, I didn't quite pick up all that bakeriness. But when burning, you really get that. It really comes through with a, a nice bakery scent with that pear scent. It was really, really good. The burn on this was, it was okay at first. It did leave residue on the side. It burned fine until the halfway point. The halfway point, it got peeny wick syndrome and I had to cotton ball it. Most of the way through the west, rest of the half of the candle. So that is what it is. I don't really mind doing that. As long as I'm getting a throw, I don't mind so much anymore if I have to cotton ball it. So I did that, cotton balled it. I cotton ball because to me, if you, when the wicks get puny, even though it's still pulled out, I don't think it throws as well as it does. If you cotton ball it, if you're new and don't know what cotton ball means, that means to blow it out. If the, that means the flames are really, really, really puny and barely showing. Looks like the candle's almost not even lit. That means the wick is almost covered with wax. There's barely any wick showing. So you blow it out, you stab a cotton ball in there, and it absorbs some wax onto that cotton ball, and it basically lowers the wax so that more of the wick is showing. It'd be the same if you dumped a little bit of wax out, but it's messy to do that. So you dab a cotton ball, it's less messy that way. And then relight it, those flames will be higher, and then it in turn I feel it throws stronger because of that that's how I've always felt I just feel like it throws stronger once you those flames are higher it gets hotter and it, and it throws better so once I did that it was fine it threw better but it was throwing I will say it was throwing really well even when it wasn't and when it did have peanut serum it was still throwing as well even when the flames weren't as high overall on the scent throw I probably give this about I say eight and a half out of ten this thing threw really good I could smell it. I had it in the bathroom most of the time, but it would waft out into the hallway. I was sitting here in the living room and I could smell it from the bathroom in there. I could smell it back in towards the bedrooms from the bathroom in here. I had I was trying to finish it up so that I could do this review the other day and I just had a little bit left. So I wanted to burn it while I was in the shower in our master bath. So I took it back there in the bathroom back there. I was in the shower and I was just smelling this and it was smelled so good. I'm like, this smells incredible. Really, really good. I really love this candle. So yes, I highly recommend this candle. If you like pear scents, bakery, sugary cinnamon, bakery, crust crumble, pear scent, I think you'd really like this. I was really, really impressed with this. And I would definitely recommend it. And I would 
I would purchase it again. I was really happy with it. So that's my review of Harvest Pear. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in our next video. Bye.